Hello all, welcome back to our channel. So students, in this video, we will discuss the damn sure questions which will be helpful for your backlog examination. So don't skip the video and watch till the end. Definitely you will able to pass this cost accounting by following my tips and tricks. Okay, so let's get into the video and everything we will discuss in this video. Okay, hope you like this total five units you are having okay so unit number one is introduction unit two is material in unit three two chapters are there labor and overheads in unit four unit costing and job costing in unit five contract costing and process costing like third fourth fifth units are having two two chapters in each unit got it so first we will understand the question paper pattern in part A, total 20 marks is the weightage of part A. 1 to 8 questions they will give. You need to attempt 5 questions. Each question carries 4 marks. It includes theory as well as problems. Okay. In part B, ninth question. From 9th question to 13th question, it will be all questions you need to attempt. Means 5 questions you need to attempt. Each question carries 12 marks. In each question, you will have internal choice. Okay. 9th question will come from unit number 1. 10th will come from unit number 2. Like that it goes on okay now we will discuss the question paper model especially in part b because part b is the most weightaged section part okay 60 marks ninth question a b 10th question a b will come from the introduction and materials okay 11th question a will come from labor 11th b will come from overheads this is also problematic we can expect this year 12th a unit or output uh, unit costing 12th b job costing 13th a contract costing 13th b process costing from unit number one basically it's a theory unit compulsory uh, most of the uh, passing marks we can get we can gain from this unit only okay only three questions i have given for the long if you are per perfect with these three questions definitely one long question one short question you will attempt which is of 12 marks long plus 4 marks short which is 16 marks weightage passing is 32 half of the marks you are scoring from unit number 1 only okay so that's why this three questions is most important it is nothing but define cost accounting explain the scope or objectives of cost accounting advantages and disadvantages differences between cost accounting and financial accounting and coming back to the short if you are perfect with the long no need to learn short okay cost accounting you will already learn in long cost sheet you will already learn in long like that only okay so for short only four questions i have given okay fixed and variable cost cost center like that okay no problematic in unit number one and in unit number two no theory is there okay there is no theory compulsory problematic only you need to learn for the long and for the short also okay so no theory in unit number two materials chapter and problematic uh, part okay whatever the questions based on the problematic i will tell you that and it is also easy chapter okay not difficult lifo fifo weighted average simple average this four problematic methods you are having in unit number two materials chapter if you are perfect with the lifo fifo weighted definitely you will attempt one long question and one short question problematic 12 marks and again four marks for short 16 marks in unit number 1 16 marks unit number 2 16 marks total 32 marks you are attempting and unit number 2 for short we can expect theory questions that is abc analysis just in time jit or else evoq economic order quantity these three are the most important theory questions okay for four marks coming back to the unit number three ma labor and overheads you are having we can't expect theory from this unit but one question is important concepts of overheads which you will get to know about this answer if you are perfect with the problematic got it mir problematic lo perfect unte aa question ki answer easy ga raashochu in labor in labor chapter what are the problematic based questions you will get time rate method halsey method rowan plan method you will have this three okay they will give some data and they will ask you to find out the problems based on the time rate halsey and rowan in labor got it and in overheads only two methods you are having overhead distribution machine over it simple technique ma in unit number three two questions you are getting in part b any one question you can attempt only one question you need to attempt either labor or overheads prepare any one chapter okay labor aina prepare avandi overheads aina prepare avandi naaku telisi overheads easy ga untundi compared to labor got it unit number four unit number three uh, theory questions for short ideal time is important okay labor turnover indirect labor cost only three three questions i am giving okay so because uh 
uh, hardly 40 or 50 days are there for the preparation you need to cover every subject no three questions is enough unit number four first we will discuss the short map job costing unit costing contract costing this three theory question answers you can easily get to answer attempt that questions by your own if you are perfect with the problematic okay so why i will suggest you to do the problematic means if you are perfect with the problematic whatever the theory question it may come in the question paper you can easily attempt that that's why give preference to the problematic in problematic subjects okay in unit costing from fourth unit we can expect to call sheet or else tender or quotation question as a problematic this is the most important okay in this two chapters is there unit costing is there job costing is there prepare any one unit if you are perfect with the unit costing only you will understand job costing okay interlinked compared to the job costing is easy but many of the thing uh, what they will do means they will give theory only in job costing better you prepare unit costing cost sheet and uh, that is very much important okay unit number five contract costing you skip this chapter go for process costing process costing problematic is very much easy anyway i will upload the explanation videos okay problematic on process costing for 12 marks compulsory question got it for short process costing abnormal gain notional profit like that only you will get it easily you can easily attempt theory answers if you are perfect with the problematic okay whatever the steps you are doing whatever the things you are having in the problematic you need to convert the answer into a theory got it so this is about the cost accounting subject i hope you have liked this video if you are having any doubts let me know in the comment section if you like this video then do like share comment and subscribe to our channel do let me know in the comment section how you felt about this video if you like this video or not last work you can see it or not you can definitely comment and we are nearly uh, near to 50k hope you subscribe to our channel if you have any doubt in the comment section you can start the explanation in the upcoming videos okay, all the very best and uh, thank you so much everyone